Hello everyone, this is Tamala, and I want to welcome you back again to another exciting episode of Designing with Hope on Design. Now, in this video today, I'm going to show you how you can make your home look expensive by using different decorative elements. So let's go ahead and jump right in. The first thing you want to do, you want to create an understated design style. Now, when it comes to creating an expensive look in a space, less is more. In this expensive living room vignette, this space has an open spacious feeling, it's not cluttered and it's not over accessorized, it's elegant and sophisticated. And this look was created by just simply carefully selecting pieces that makes an expensive look in the space. Now, I want to talk about one of the key components to a space and that is lighting. And we all know that lighting is very crucial when it comes to designing or decorating a space. So if you are planning on installing chandeliers, sconces, or pendants, my suggestion would be to choose lighting that will make a dramatic statement in the space. Now, don't go use your run-of-the-mill local retail distributors. This will be the perfect time to work with a designer to be able to use our resources to land that one-of-a-kind designer chandelier, sconces, or pendant lighting, which will give your space an expensive look. So now let's talk about the decorative elements that can make a space look expensive. I found this decorative box in one of the local Dallas showrooms. It is a fairly large box that is made to look like a turtle, that is a square turtle, but the legs and the head are made of a solid brass material and the box itself is made up of mosaic natural stone with the brass butterfly sitting on top. Now, this is a very expensive box. I'm not going to reveal the price to avoid sticker shock, but it is, a, it is decorative items like this box that can make a very expensive statement on a coffee table or inside of a bookcase. Next, you want to incorporate sculptural art in interesting shapes or unique silhouettes. Most expensive homes have an extensive sculptural art collection placed throughout the home. I have started incorporating at least one sculptural art piece in each room of my home. This hanging man sculpture art is on display on one of the columns in my foyer area. This is the first piece of sculpture art that you see when you enter into my home. So now, continuing talking about collections, Displaying Antique Collections is another way to make your home look expensive. This is my antique collection of blue and white dishes that I am displaying on the wall in my kitchen now that my kitchen has been painted with a fresh coat of gray paint. So by showcasing my antique collection together as a collection, and the keyword is together, it makes my home feel well-traveled, thoughtfully decorated, and it feels collected over time, which are all indicators of an expensive look. And lastly, using large-scale art is another way to make your space look expensive. Using large-scale art can create a focal point and make a huge statement in the space Again, this is when you would want to work with a designer to ensure that you get the right art piece that will be in scale and proportion to the space, but also bring the room together since it's going to be the focal point in the space. So now, as you can see, by incorporating the right decorative elements, you can make your home look and feel expensive. And once again, thanks for watching Designing with Hope on Design, designing for the home, body, and soul. Bye for now.